What is that? You tell me. Carcass by Soutine, 1925. It's not on the syllabus. No, it's not. Is it any good? Hmm? Come on, ladies. There's no wrong answer. There's also no textbook telling you what to think. It's not that easy, is it? All right, no. It's not good. In fact, I wouldn't even call it art. It's grotesque. Is there a rule against art being grotesque? I think there's something ag aggressive about it. And erotic. Mm -hmm. To you, everything is erotic. Yeah, everything is erotic. Girls. <laughs> Aren't there standards? Of course there are. Otherwise, a tacky velvet painting could be equated to a Rembrandt. Hey, my Uncle Freddy has two tacky velvet paintings. He loves those clowns. <laughs> there are standards, technique, composition, color, even subject. So if you're suggesting that rotted side of meat is art, much less good art, then what are we going to learn? Just that. You have outlined our new syllabus, Betty. Thank you. What is art? What makes it good or bad, and who decides? Next slide, please. 25 years ago, someone thought this was brilliant. I can see that. Who? <laughs> My mother. I painted it for her birthday. <laughs> Next slide. This is my mom. Is it art? It's a snapshot. If I told you Ansel Adams had taken it, would that make a difference? Art isn't art until someone says it is. It's art. <laughs> the right people? Who are they? Betty Warren. We're so lucky we have one of them right here. <laughs> <laughs> Could you go back to the Soutine 